All right, here we are. <clears throat> Does this sound any better? This is a new microphone. Actually, it's an old microphone, but I've resurrected it. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on with the audio. All right, taking a midday break, heading to the post office, and uh, ugh, gotta stretch, stay cool out there, and don't get wet. microphone the microphone this is the old microphone as you can see there's got tape on it super glue so this i have another one and i'm using it right now i don't know if it really works hopefully i, I know you can hear me but i don't know what the quality is like anyway i digress all right folks comment of the week right comment of the week it's time it's time but it's also time for the postcard of the week the postcards just keep coming in. I believe this is number five. Thank you. I am so glad I got a P.O. box. Thank you for encouraging me, especially Bud, to get a P.O. box. Everybody out there, this is amazing. And if this keeps up, if you guys keep this up, we're going to have to do a postcard of the week as well. All right, here we go. This is the postcard. It's one of those um, postagram where you can upload photos from your phone and then they mail you the photos in a postcard form. Pretty sweet, pretty sweet. Postagramapp.com, a little free promotion for them. That is not a paid advertisement, by the way. All right, here it is from Marion. Marion wrote, hello, wonderful Demore family. Thought I would send you a collection of pictures of your favorite sister. You can add it to your postcard collection Love your vlog. Thanks for reminding us to seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. Love, Marion. Ah, Marion, thank you, thank you, thank you for taking the time uh, to send this to us. I will show this to true love tonight. She's going to flip out. All right, on to the comment of the week, which this was like a no-brainer. Oh my gosh, this is just such a great one. It's pretty long, so bear with me. I'm not going to talk much about it other than to say thank you, Damien for sharing about your story. Here it goes. And this is in connection to the question of the day, what is your first name? So I asked that question last, uh, maybe Friday or Thursday, because I was just curious, because there was people commenting, but I didn't know your first name. And I wanna, I wanna be on a first name basis. So Damien took the time to explain his first name. Here it is. My name is Damien, named after St. Damien of Molokai. We went to Hawaii for my for our honeymoon and boated over to Molokai for one of our excursions. Got to see Father Damien's leper colony, amazing, and his church, St. Philomena's. We hiked down the sea cliff and on our way back up, my wife fell and cut open her wrist on the rocks. It was just us. Our guide was well behind us with a girl he brought along who was just wearing flip-flops for footwear. Thankfully, I stopped the bleeding. Our guide finally caught up with us, but had no first aid kit. Some guide. Uh, she got treated on the ferry ride back. Waters were choppy like the opening scene of Gilligan's Island. Cue the music. I lost my mocha mama drink, found a doctor on call and got stitches. The next morning at 4 a.m. we biked down a volcano. My wife did so one-handed. I also have 12 middle names, but that's another story. Oh my God, that's an amazing comment. I don't know where the whole like, I lost my mocha mama drink. I don't know what that means, Damien, but other than that, that's an amazing comment of the week. Thank you as always, and in case you did not know, every Monday I read the best comment from the previous seven days. So, I'll give you a shout out in the comment below. Oh yeah, and don't forget to check out Damien's channel in the description below, go check it out. He's got great vlogs, great videos of his family up in Wisconsin. All right, that's that. Time to head home, actually going for a run, then head home. Family's at the park. Look what I found. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, indeed. Steak. Steak. Steak.
steak. Mm. Sorry I'm eating with my fingers, but uh, when you're hungry and nobody else is around, you gotta fend for yourself. Mm. Thank you, hon. Maybe dad for sending the steak. <coughs> Don't mind if I do. Dang. You'll have to show me. Fine, look what came in the mail. What? To the P.O. Box. Oh, Isn't yes. that... I love you, Marion. Love you, Marion. Oh, my golly. That's the sweetest thing I've ever that's seen. That's the best postcard we've ever had. Yes, sir. Thank you, Marion, for taking oh care of us. Oh, my gosh. Love it. Love it. I love all of them. Right? You can learn a lot about a man in his uh, shed slash garage. <laughs> Oh man, here we are. Boom. Boom. All right. That is for you. And uh, just wrapping up this day. It's about 7.30. We put our boys down to bed early. We're not afraid. Be not afraid of the early bedtime. You know, they just, especially, they're not napping anymore, really. So we're not afraid to put them down early because they just start losing it at like 6. I mean, we're talking... Meltdown City. But, um, anywho, God love them. They're just trying to make it in this world just like you. I don't know. Hey, you go. Beauty. Work hard at your dishes. <laughs> is that the yes? It is. Is that the question of the day? Yes, it is. Do you do your dishes via the hand or via the dishwasher? How do you do your dishes? How do you prefer to do your dishes? Um, do you like doing your dishes? However you want to answer that, you just comment below. Appreciate it. And love each other. <laughs> by doing each other's dishes.